Hi and welcome to another video of Lecture Tutorial Series. In this video, we are going to test the recipe with the Dev tool. This video is actually the continuation of the previous video. In previous video, we have seen how to create a recipe using Dev tool, which is on Makefile build system based recipe. In this video, we are going to deploy our output to the target. Then we will test it on the target and then we will undeploy it from the target. Now our target is BeagleBone Black. I have, I have connected the BeagleBone Black to my system using SSH. Previously we have created a binary name factorial which calculates the factorial of a given number. Right now if we check in our system BeagleBone Black factorial is not present, command not found. Now what we will do is we will deploy the output to the the output binary to our BeagleBone Black. For that, we need to know the IP address. So, if you do ifconfig, so our IP address is 192.168.7.2. Now, what we are going to do is we ha we need to deploy this our binary to the target. I have already sourced my workspace. The command to deploy it to the target is devtool deploy dash target. Then the name of the recipe that we have the one that we want to deploy and that has already been built factorial and then the SSH path. So the recipe has been deployed. If now we try to run here factorial, you can see that the command is now present. Factorial. And now it is asking for a number. Let us give it 6. So it has calculated the factorial of 6 is 720. One more thing here is if we check the path of our output binary using which command which tutorial so you can see that it is in user bin it has automatically been deployed to the user bin because in our recipe we have installed it to the user bin folder that's why it has been automatically been deployed to the user bin now we have seen that our recipe is working fine now we can undeploy the recipe and then we can create the final recipe and we can export that final recipe to our normal layer folders or normal layer system. So to undeploy the recipe, the command is almost same. Instead of deploy target, we need to use undeploy target. So the successfully undeployed factorial. Now if we check once again which factorial so this time you see that it doesn't give the path and furthermore if we again try to run this factorial binary so it says command not found. It means that now the final output has been successfully undeployed for our system. We have deployed the target we have tested and we have undeployed it and it works perfectly. If I do the summary, first of all, we did the add, we modified the recipe, we built the recipe, we deployed the recipe, we tested the recipe in our target system and we have deployed the undeployed the recipe from our tar target system. Now what we need to do is, we need to finalize our recipe and we need to put it in our meta tab layer and that we will do in the next tutorial. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe my channel and I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.